Hello, my name is Olivia Albanese, and this is my photo essay on Paolo Freire's Pedagogy of the Oppressed. Through Paolo Freire's work, I was able to see myself through a different lens. As a future social worker, I value meaningful relationships. I want to take the time to actively listen to each client. This is something that I find important in both a professional and personal setting. Paolo also reminded me of the importance of setting aside my biases so that I may truly be helpful to somebody. The first main idea that I took away from this novel was the idea of praxis. This is taking theory and turning it into practice or real world applications. A goal of mine that I hope to conquer in my social work profession is to actively work with my clients. I, I want to help them fight oppression and even my own tendencies to oppress at times. In a way, I believe solidarity is a direct result of praxis. Solidarity is another term introduced in Freire's Pedagogy of the Oppressed. Once I put my action into plans, then I can fight alongside the oppressed. This novel opened my eyes to the idea that in some instances in our lives, we may have been oppressors ourselves. I think Freire's goal here was to create a true awareness in us. Furthermore, in my social work profession, I want to set aside all biases and knowledge that I have about the world. And I want to treat each client with dignity and respect. I do not want to oppress them any more than they already have been. Lastly, dialogue is another concept I never considered until now. Instead of being a social worker who just spits out information or gives my clients a strict list to follow of do's and don'ts, I want to encourage them as well as encourage open dialogue so that I may establish a fuller and more understanding relationship with them. Dialogue can help bring about social change and give the oppressed a chance to be heard. Communities can come together despite of their challenges to battle their oppressors. Although I have a deep desire to help others, I have learned that this helping profession will not be an easy career. Emotional bracketing and true generosity will be required to make a successful social worker. I hope this was a helpful reflection on Paolo Freire's Pedagogy of the Oppressed. Thanks.